Let's talk about this studded hat. This was worn in 2011, the Super Bowl halftime show. And Slash is such a great guy. Great performer. Chrome Hearts, a New York hat company hat, those studs. This is a cool Really hat. great. He performed with Black Eyed Peas. <laughs> <laughs> it was very you, Maria. Sorry, the, I had the to value try it just, on. 10, to, 10 to 12 on this, but the value just went up, Maria. You're after rocking it out there. <laughs> <laughs> so you're thinking 10 to $20,000 you can get up for that, that hat. Absolutely. Again, yeah. Slash is highly collectible. He's a huge loyal fan base. Uh, we got to talk about L. Elvis. Okay, Absolutely. so let's talk about some of the look items you brought from Elvis. There's over 70 items wow. from Elvis going on the auction block, but look at this. Okay. Horseshoe ring. He wore it in wow. the Aloha Hawaii ring. concert performance, 1973, watched by a billion people. This There's 19 fantastic. carats of diamonds on your finger right now, 14 carat gold, 160 to 180,000 before you wore it, Maria. Wow, this is 14 <laughs> carat, this 14 carat yellow gold. Exactly, and then 19, 19 carats of diamonds. 10.5 is the center. 10.5 is the center yeah, diamond. And then the 11 diamonds make up about eight and a quarter. He really wore some jewels. He huh? certainly did. And then we have another one here with a uh, diamond and sapphire. Uh, and this one is estimated in a more affordable range, 10 to 12 million, Maria. This thing sparkles. Wow. That sparkles, yes. I love it. And this he wore it for about cool. two years after that Aloha performance, and then he gave it to his doctor in Las Vegas, Dr. Ganem. And the sapphire and diamond ring, you think, we, will go yeah, up we, for 10 to 10 12? 10 to 12,000. Yeah. Again, 14 karat gold, but great photographs of Elvis. There's a magazine cover with Elvis uh, wearing that ring at the Aloha performance in Hawaii. So, so cool. Look, really there he is and wearing the ring. Yeah, and we have about 70 lots of Elvis. I love it. And then of course, cool. Maria, we have. All right, I'm going to give you. I'm going to give you this back now. <laughs> this ring back. We have over 375 lots going on the auction block on Saturday at Julian's Auctions. But so, also, so we have amazing Be Beach Boys. Beach Boys, boys. yeah. Tell us about There's the Beach about Boys. 45 lots from the Beach Boys, and again, highly collectible, great documents. You see the first royalty check, manuscripts, lyrics. You know, we're going to make some waves on Saturday with the Beach Boys wow. because they're highly sought after. And very rarely does anything from the Beach Boys come to the auction block. Fantastic. You didn't tell us about this guitar. <laughs> I'm keeping the best to last. Maria. This is Pete Townsend from The Who wow. in, in the 1970s. Again, we estimate this 60 to 80,000. Really great. He performed with this guitar, we believe, at Live at Leeds and also with the Rolling Stones Circus performance This concert. is wood, huh? This is wood. This is it's pretty heavy, right? Yeah, it's, it's heavy. It's, 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 it's a Gibson SG 1964 guitar. Yeah. So again, Really great piece and very historical piece, and of course the Who are highly collectible, Incredible. including Pipe Towns. And you see him actually there, Maria, holding the guitar. Oh, there's a picture so there's of him the holding picture, the guitar. Yes. Yeah, that's a good one. There it is. Music icons. I think you're going to get a lot of interest for this. Huge people love interest. music, and, they, and, and it, it resonates with people. They, they are familiar uh, with the jacket and the guitar and the boot and things, and, and of course Elvis's rings. Absolutely. And here in New York City, where they love rock and roll, and it's at the Hard Rock Cafe, it's, it's a perfect situation. It's going to be a great auction. Right? <laughs> Good luck with it, Martin. Thank you so great much. Great to have you. Thanks for walking Always us through a it. Pleasure. We'll Always see you at the pleasure. Hard Rock Cafe yes, for the definitely. music icons. Martin Nolan there from Julian's.